Hello everyone, Tyronzil here and welcome to my channel. This is a brief video tutorial on how to make video telegram stickers. That's right, so recently Telegram released a new update that allows us to upload videos in a WebM format in order to use that as a st animated sticker. So that is absolutely amazing for us because it means we don't have to go through all the proprietary Adobe stuff and complicated vectors in order to make our sticker. Instead, we can just create any old GIF or GIF for that, or any video for that matter. Just convert that to a WebM and then and use that as our sticker. So as you can see in my Photoshop, I already have a nice little video uh, GIF animation. And of course, you don't have to use Photoshop. You could, of course, just use Blender and create a nice 3D uh, render animation and convert that as video or any video for that matter or any GIF, uh, any art software that you can use to create animated GIFs. But for now, uh, in this video, I'm just going to use Photoshop because that's what I have. So first things first, what we want to do is we want to save this for, it, for web as a GIF format. So Photoshop, we do that as save for web, and then we can save that as a GIF. Be sure to highlight here, click on GIF, that's what we want. Otherwise it won't animate. Next thing you want to do, make sure to select the image size to 512 by 512. Because that is the image size, the maximum image size that Telegram will accept. So make sure to change that to 512 by 512 pixels. Then next, if you are working in Photoshop, be sure to hit on transparency um, and make sure that's checked. If you don't, you'll get this really ugly black background and nobody wants that because that's just really ugly. Unless of course your GIF animation has a background. So just hit transparency and then make sure to hit on diffusion transparency differ as well. If you don't do that, you'll get a nasty, ugly white border around it. And that's not really nice. Um, otherwise, and also be sure to click on matte and drag this all the way down to black because otherwise you'll definitely get an ugly white border around your sticker. And we don't want that. Unless, of course, your sticker has a white uh, a white outline, then of course leave it as white. But since we have the black uh, outline, I'm just going to choose black. Choose this as the fifth transparency, which will reduce the ugly white border. It doesn't remove it entirely, but it does minimize it. If someone out there knows a method of removing it entirely, please do let me know. Um, but otherwise, I'm just going to stick with this method. So. Once that's all done, just hit save. Save your sticker as a 512 by 512 GIF uh, with transparency and just hit that. Save this. So now we have saved our GIF. Let's just go check it out wherever you saved your GIF. Mine is saved in this music folder over here. And we just click open and there we can see our nice little animated GIF. Gorgeous, isn't it? Listening to music. So now that we have our awesome little GIF, we can't use that as a sticker. We have to convert that to a web um, video in order for Telegram to use it. So the best method I've found go to use a little thing called FFmpeg. Now that is a software that's inside of Python, and we will have to use the Python command prompt called Anaconda. So I will leave a link in the video description on where to download it. But if you just want to search it yourself, all you need to do is literally just Google or DuckDuckGo Miniconda. Click on Miniconda and then find the conda you want for your respective operating system. So for mine, I'm just going to hit over here. Miniconda for Windows 64 bit. Hit that and then just save that file. Now, I already have that file on my PC in my downloads folder, so I'm not just I'm not going to download it again. Instead, I'm just going to go straight 
to my downloads folder. So as you can see, right there is my mini Conda installer for Windows. Double click on it, and there we go, Conda. Let's go through the setup process as you would normally do with any other software. I'm going to change mine to the D drive because my mini Conda software usually rests on the D drive. So the next thing, uh, so that install and just wait for it to install. It's going to take a bit of time. So let me briefly pause the video and I'll be back. Uh, and now that our Miniconda has installed, um, then all you need to do is just hit finish and check both these because we don't need that. So now we have Miniconda installed, let's just go ahead and open our Python Anaconda prompt. Over here, just go to start and look for your wherever it's installed. So over here, we have our Anaconda prompt. That's a little Python uh, command prompt. For those of you who don't know. So what we need to do next, we need to install FFmpeg. So over on the website, I will leave another link in the video description, but what you want to do is you want to just copy the command for installing FFmpeg. Just copy that, go back to your prompt and hit on, just right click in the in the command prompt and then hit enter. And after that, just wait a short moment whilst it unpacks everything in order to, uh, to get the package installed. Once you see this, it'll ask you if you want to install it, yes or no, just hit Y and enter. This will take a about a minute or two, depending on speed and how fast your PC is. Now that that's installed, what we want to do next is we want to actually convert our little GIF here into the FF uh, into the WebM video. Yeah. So I have a command for that as well, just nicely saved in my notepad, which I will leave in below. So right here, this is what it is: just FFmpeg and all the stuff that we don't really. You understand what they mean. Go here and uh, ooh, first things first. Actually, what we need to do is we need to move this directory into wherever our GIF happens to be. So, since my uh, since my sticker is on the D drive, the first thing I need to do is go to D. So D colon, and then just go to your file explorer. Find wherever your GIF is, go up here and just copy. Copy that, go back to your Anaconda prompt and then just type in CD space and right click it. You'll paste the entire thing there, hit enter. Now you should be in the correct directory for where your sticker is. So what you do next is you go copy this entire command just change this thing here to name of your GIF and the name of whatever it is you want to call your new video. Copy that back here, right click, paste that in, hit enter. Now that should convert it to a, to a WebM video. Then you can just go here and open it up. Now, as you can see, this is our video Unfortunately, VLC doesn't do a very good job of playing it, but that's okay because trust me, it will work in Telegram. So let's just go to Telegram and look for the sticker bot. If you don't know how to look for stickers, it's just at stickers. 
Now that we're at the sticker board, what we want to do is we want to make our music video. So what we do is we type in slash new video. And of course, we want to create the name of our pack. So for this, I'm just going to name it a tutorial video, because why not? Then just send our sticker in a web format. Just drag it in here. There's our video. Send it to Telegram. And as you can see, it plays out just fine. Select an associated emoji. Um, music. See if it plays it out. There we go. We have headphones. Type that in and hit enter. Now that our video sticker has an associated uh, emoji, just hit the publish. And there we have that. Just click skip unless you want to create your own icon. There we go. We have that. Uh, oh, Telegram still wants us to make a name for it. So I'm just going to go up here and just copy whatever I called it. Test tutorial video. There we go. Paste and enter. Boom, and now it's published. Fantastic. Hit here. Ooh, it's coming, it's coming. And there we go. Here's our sticker, all working in story. Fantastic. Hit that again, and hit that again. So I hope this video was um, very helpful. And if you liked the video, just like, subscribe, etc. You know the drill, and thank you for watching. This is Tyrone Still.